Hello, Alex Sokolsky here with a quick tip on importing GH4 footage into Sony Vegas. So here I have uh, GH4 footage, uh, quite a lot of it actually. And that's how I import it into a newly created project in Sony Vegas. So I just drag and drop it and uh, as Sony will process those uh, QuickTime files uh, to build audio peaks. Uh, also, I take it for granted that uh, QuickTime is the best recording format for GH4. I didn't compare myself, but uh, the opinion is that it's far superior to AVC HD or MP4. So I'm recording in 4K uh, QuickTime container at about 100 megabit per second uh, rate. So we're almost there. The footage is processed and uh, this is 1080p project. Uh, it asked me would I want to change the project. I do not. So I'm downscaling the footage to uh, 2K. So the first thing that you may notice is that uh, the audio and video track length are not the same. Uh, this is not an important part. Uh, I just uh, learned to ignore it. Uh, and here's what I do. I click on the end of uh, audio footage and then I pressed Alt closing bracket. I also will use Ripple to speed things up. Uh, thus, I just get rid of this extra video track length. So this allows me to trim uh, duration uh, of the clips to what they actually are. So this Alt closing bracket is one of the most useful uh, keyboard accelerators that uh, I use in uh, Sony Vegas dealing with GH4 footage. And the second important thing uh, is uh, when, when I dragged and drop the order of clips was most likely uh, messed up. So here I start with uh, two six clip and uh, the next one is to one six. So this is clearly wrong. I switched uh, from normal edit uh, to shuffle tool. And then I just drag it. So just to verify, I have two one six, two one seven. And usually it's either the first two or the last two that uh, are, are placed out of order. And two to three, two to four, two to five. And two to six. And that's pretty much it. The footage is in Sony Vegas Pro. And I hope it's relevant and useful. Thank you very much.